Hey, if you're anything like me, you are extremely annoyed at how god-awful and terrible Meta's Link software has been. How god-awful and terrible everything about Meta has been. Meta has been completely terrible and it is so annoying. I have a few really simple stuff that should help a little bit, even if only for a little bit, until Meta fixes their stupid software and the update that broke the, all of Link. How on earth are you so incompetent that you release an update that completely breaks your entire software that already didn't work good in the first place? I don't know. But hey, that's multi-billion dollar companies for you. The first thing you're going to want to do, it sounds really stupid, I know, but genuinely it helps so much, is just unplug and replug the cable as many times as you need to. Because it will take a lot of times. You're not just going to get this first try, you're going to need to do this multiple times. Another thing that is really helpful to do as well, if that doesn't start work, doing a combination of this and going at the task manager and completely closing the Oculus software. That used to help me before, before the update uh, that completely broke the entire thing. Not so much anymore. It's, it's, I've still used it to get on to record this. <laughs> Ironically, but um The big one the big one that really helped me the two big ones that really helped me Were repairing the software. So what you want to do for that is you want to go to the Installer that you use to install the oculus app click on the installer again run it again The little menu should pop up what you want to do is click repair then repair again Until it just reinstalls and completely repairs the app uh on top of that, what you can do is go into your headset boot settings or boot menu by powering on the headset and holding the down volume button and you can use the volume buttons to navigate through the menu and from there you can factory reset the headset. From there you're just going to want to follow through the uh, set whole setup process of the headset all over again, you know, just like when you bought the headset, just set it up with the little mobile phone app, link it, use the cable. Uh, do all that stuff and you should should be able to play at least for a little bit and let's just hope to god that they manage to fix their fucking software uh, because you have to go and solve a multi-billion dollar company's problems <laughs> ha, ha. but resetting the headset really helped uh, to get my thing actually working it still took a bit of finicking with the cable and restarting the software and all that to get on. Uh, there's no guarantee for how long you're going to get on before it crashes again, so that's playing against the clock with this one here, but um, uh, something tells me that they're going to take another six months to release an update that fixes uh, the update that broke their terrible software. Because that's, you know, that's how Meta handles their, their, uh, their Link software. They don't fucking care about it at all. So that's, yeah, that's how that goes. That's just how that goes, yeah? I can't do nothing about that. But I uh, tried to keep this short and concise and just to help anyone who needs the help because fuck, God knows. Everyone who's ever used a link cable... Oh, everyone who's ever used a link cable needs the help because it sucks and it's terrible.